Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I'm Rachel and today I'm going to be doing a video on how I style my jeans for winter. And if you've seen my past video on jeans for women with larger thighs, this is an extension of that uh, because I have a couple different jeans that are newer but also jeans that I've been wearing for the past year plus. So if you're interested in how I style my jeans, then just keep on watching. So for my first outfit, I have my Levi's dad jeans. And I know I've mentioned these in a couple different videos now. They are some of my absolute favorite. I know that the color is not really for everybody, but, you know, I think that they are the perfect kind of replacement for the mom jeans. And I do have a mom jeans that I featured in my video on my favorite jeans. And I've definitely swapped those out for these jeans in particular. And how I've styled these jeans and how I often style them is simply with a black turtleneck sweater. This one's from Diane von Furstenberg and I got it thrifted. And my shoes are just a simple black pointed toe heeled boot that I absolutely love. And what's perfect is that they are super tight to the ankle and so they really do flatter this kind of shape of jean. Um, and make your legs still look longer even though the jean is technically kind of a crop for me. And I've paired it with this oversized camel coat from Zara, which I think is the perfect kind of replacement for what I would like to be a Max Mara coat, but cannot afford. So for now, I have the kind of a Zara alternative. And in general, this, you know, outfit is really just a super kind of chic, simple, casual, but a little bit more upscale version of an everyday outfit. And I think it's perfect for going to the grocery store, for doing whatever. You can go anywhere in this outfit and it is just really comfortable, but you look super pulled together. And I always love the idea of having a little kind of handheld bag. So I have my little vintage coach here, but a great alternative to that, especially when you have such a large coat and you want to wear a crossbody, is to actually layer your crossbody underneath the coat and you can either drape your coat over your shoulders or you can just kind of wear it under because the coat is so large that the bag actually fits perfectly. So that's what you see here. Another way I'm loving to wear these dad jeans is really kind of a throwback to the 90s. And I know not everyone's going to be a huge fan of this outfit, but you know it really is just kind of a fun way to play with a 90s look. So I'm pairing my jeans with a simple t-shirt from Target, so black tee, and one of my cardigans. So cardigans are huge right now. That's kind of, you know, back into style for winter. Uh, and kind of the layering is perfect for wearing a cardigan that has a lower neckline. But, you know, if you want to stay warm, you do need to layer. And I've topped that with a just a simple black trench um, that is a leather trench, and I got that thrifted. Um, and so I think overall it just makes for like a cute little throwback outfit. I've paired it with a pair of Stan Smith sneakers. Um, again, it's not for everybody, but it is just kind of like a fun casual. Again, go to the grocery store, you want to walk in this because it is so comfortable. But you look just a little bit more fun and a little bit more fashionable um, with all of the little layered pieces. So the next pair of jeans that I'm wearing right now are from Reformation. And they're actually called the Cynthia... And these are in the long version. And I know what I said before about Reformation jeans in my last jeans video. But I have definitely come around with these pair of jeans. I'm ordering another pair. Um, but these ones come in black. And they're actually called something else. But I can't remember the name. Again, down below in the comments. And the way that I'm loving to wear these jeans is with a simple black turtleneck. Again, this is my Diane von Furstenberg or DVF turtleneck that I thrifted. And then on top of that, I have my Reformation coat that I got. And I had this in my favorite purchases of 2020 video. It is such a great jacket. It's really simple. And I like how long it is because along with the jeans, it just kind of fully elongates you. And then I've paired this with this Sam Edelman chunky Chelsea boot. And I just got these. They are waterproof. They are very nice. Um, and I definitely would suggest them if you're going for that kind of chunky boot trend, which is a little bit more fashionable than just wearing like a traditional style boot, um, but without having to spend a ton of money on a trend. So these are definitely a great option and a great pull together look. So another way I'm wearing the same jeans are with just another turtleneck, but this is a chunkier knit turtleneck. I got this one at Zara. And on top of that, I've put my thrifted blazer and I love this because you know the color palette itself is a little bit different than just like a traditional black or a traditional brown it has a lot of green undertones which is why it matches so nicely and I think too it gives like a really kind of polished almost like college kind of look or a little bit like British um maybe people from England would disagree <laughs> that this is kind of a British outfit but I do like the way it looks when you layer a chunky knit with a blazer and then again I've paired this with the same pair of chunky boots and just a simple black bag 
uh, and it just feels really pulled together. So my next pair of jeans are from Levi's. These are in my last jeans video. These are the Levi's ribcage jeans and they are the cropped version. They do have a little bit of a flare at the ankle and I know some people don't like that but I actually do love these because they still stay fairly straight compared to a lot of other kind of cropped jeans. And I've paired this with one of my And Other Story sweaters uh, that is so comfortable and I absolutely love and it's a really just kind of nice neutral tone. And I paired this with my Zara coat that I love. This is a Zara wrap coat um, and it is one of my best purchases ever. I wear it all the time, probably my most worn coat. And then I've just paired that with a pair of vintage coach loafers and my vintage coach bag just to kind of pull together a look with something a little bit more simple. So I'm wearing my same cropped ribcage jeans from Levi's and this time I'm wearing it with a different turtleneck. This one is from Numi, which is a Canadian brand um, that I really enjoy and I love to wear this when I was working um, outside of the home and because they have these little like sweat pads in them and I've just paired this for kind of more of like an outdoorsy quote-unquote look because I've paired it with my plaid jacket which I know is not a true outdoorsy jacket but it's kind of on trend right now to have these kind of thicker plaid shirt jackets. Um, they're not necessarily the most functional, but they definitely are cute um, and definitely kind of an Instagrammable outfit. And then I've paired those again with the Sam Edelman chunky boots. Again, I swear these boots are amazing. They are waterproof. So you could technically wear this somewhere a little bit more kind of outdoorsy. And the last pair of jeans that I will mention are the ribcage wide leg jeans. I have been saying since last year that these are up and coming, these are amazing, people are going to love them, and definitely wide leg pants are back in style. And I'm loving to wear these with, again, some layered pieces. So here I have it with a t-shirt, simple t-shirt, very cheap from Target, and I've topped that with one of my cardigans that is super fuzzy from And Other Stories. And if you need that extra layer, I've topped on top of that my Top Shot coat that is this kind of like plaid... Um, plaid black and white that I've had for I think now like four plus years and again it makes for just a super cute black and white combination I've paired that with a pointed toe boot so it looks a little bit more chic and then my top handle bag and I think it's the perfect balance of like a really feminine outfit so for my last outfit I've just paired my wide leg jeans with my pointed toe boots again these are from Franco Sarto I believe that's how you say it, and in and other story sweater in this nice kind of light cream color, and my long Zara coat. Again, just such a classic outfit, something I would wear every single day, especially back when we were working. So that's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget this video a thumbs up, and you could subscribe if you would like to, and let me know in the comments below what is your favorite place to buy jeans right now, or just in general, any places I'm missing, let me know, and I will see you in my next video.